with just the number 1 we can pretty much get to any natural number that exists 1 plus 1 is 2 2 plus 1 is 3 3 plus 1 is 4 and so on the beauty of addition but is there any way that we can get to 0 by adding a number to 1 is it possible now let's try something interesting here's an apple with me so initially I had 0 apples and now I have 1 apple here that means plus 1 and what if I take away this 1 apple that's minus 1 now I'm left with 0 apples so adding 1 and taking away 1 makes the apple balance out this helps us understand that when we add a number and its opposite like 1 and minus 1 we get back to where we started at 0 therefore plus 1 plus minus 1 is 0 it can also be written as 1 plus minus 1 is 0 let's understand this further look here we have a few chips some are positive representing positive 1 some are negative representing negative 1 so if we do our very first problem we take a positive chip and a negative chip this represents 0 together let's do some more math say we want to add 7 plus 2 so first we take 7 positive chips 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 and now we take another two positive chips like this so if we add them all what do we get we get nine chips easy peasy right you can see it on a number line too seven plus two means seven steps to the right and then another two steps to the right we land on number nine now let's make it a bit more challenging what if we change 2 to minus 2 so 7 plus minus 2 hmm we take 7 positive chips and then we take 2 negative chips like this we know that one positive chip and one negative chip is nothing but 0 so if we arrange them like this we can say that these two pairs represent 0 then what are we left with we are left with five positive chips so the answer is five even on the number line seven means seven steps to the right and to add minus two we move two steps to the left and we land on number five now from our first problem what if we change seven to minus seven for that we remove these seven positive chips and bring in the seven negative chips like this now the problem becomes minus seven plus two now to solve it we can see over here we have two pairs of plus and minus so this becomes zero so that our answer would be five negative chips that is minus five same thing on the number line seven steps to the left and then two steps to the right we get minus five if you look closely when you're adding a negative integer like in the first problem of one plus minus one or the later seven plus minus two technically we are subtracting two numbers so whenever a positive integer and a negative integer are added like 7 plus minus 2 you can just subtract 7 and 2 and put the sign of the greater one to get the answer which is plus 5 and that's it for today we have understood the addition of integers using chips as well as the number line now you go out there try all sorts of problems involving the addition of integers just a thought we didn't try a case of adding both negative integers like minus 7 plus minus 2. What would the answer be? Tell us in the comments below and stay tuned while we'll be back with subtraction of integers in another episode of Concept Bites.